this is simple journaling with art foamies. So um, full disclosure, I am a designer for art foamies and I do have my line of stamps and things over there. I will include a link to their website down below and you can search by designer. There's some really great folks over there.
There is another um, art journal page done with Art Foamies. These are just simple, quick, easy pages, a way to express yourself and what you're thinking or what you're feeling in your art journal without having to worry about um, the fact that you can't draw or you feel like you can't draw or you feel like you can't do this or can't do that. Just grab some Art Foamies, slap some Art Foamies, Art foamies, slap some paint or ink on them and have at it. I used um, gouaches today, water soluble gouache and also acrylic gouache, which is, um, once it's dry, this is permanent, that's like watercolor. Um, you can also use ink, which will be in a future episode. Um, and I then I embellish them with colored pencils, which I have right here handy on the desk. And the things that I wrote on here were just what came to me as I was creating the page. It doesn't have to be um, Picasso. Just express yourself and have fun with it. Art Foamies are a great tool to do that with, and I encourage you to check out their website. They are a USA-based company, a little mom and pop, and I know they would appreciate your support. So check them out, their link is down below. Don't forget to have fun, stay creative, stay safe, stay healthy, and go out and do something nice for yourself because you deserve it. Have fun with your art foamies and your art journaling, and I'll see you in the next video. Bye, guys. I will say art foamy tip. Um, so you will notice in the videos that I have this, um, this is actually a cafeteria tray with a piece of chamois um, in it cut to fit. It's damp, and you'll notice in the beginning of the video that I got it wet. I have found that I've, when I'm using paint especially, um, that when I'm using my stamps, if I put them face down on something that's damp, the paint doesn't dry on the stamp and it's much easier to just clean off, rinse off, wipe off um, than if I'm having an hour long um, art journaling or painting session with them and then I go to clean them afterwards and the paint's dry on the stamp and it's like a pain to get off. Um, so this is, I know KP has a lot of different tips and tricks for keeping your stamps clean. This seems to work for me and um, so give it a try. Maybe you have a dollar store cookie sheet or something like that and a rag you can put in the bottom. And um, yeah, it works for me and you can see that this paint is still damp. So I'll be able to get those off fairly easily. So there's my art foamy cleaning tip. All right, and it, I can wipe it off with a paper towel, a baby wipe, or I can go rinse it out under the sink. So anyway. There you go. There you have art journaling with art foamies. All right. Having fun with it. <laughs>